I see what old chaps and chef, it's game chef on Bertie here. Yes. Yes, videos, and I dare say we are discussing here quite a controversial item that's been in the news lately, namely our Nintendo Doomdale Boy. Well, indeed, are they heading for the proverbial trash can? Well, we hope not, videos. Well, no, Nintendo recently forecasted another year of losses, saying they expect to lose 25 billion yen. How much is that? Two pounds fifty in English. Th that's a lot of money. In fact, that's 244 million US dollars. My, what? That much money in the year ending March the 31st, 2014, instead of a profit of 55 billion yen, or about 537 million US dollars. I see. Well, indeed, videos, this, of course, comes on top of the loss they made in 2012, which was their first loss in about 30 years, being 43 billion yen worth of loss, you know. That's a lot of loss. That's a lot of loss. Now, the question, videos, why is this, I say? Uh, well, perhaps it's because poor old Mario is just not as interesting to people as he used to be. And the old Mario players are all dying out! Uh, yes, but it's... Th hold on. Thank you for that information, that was most useful. Yes, I you say this about to be here? Stop it and stop it! Uh, I, uh, I, I, I dare say, more likely, the causes are many, but I dare say, firstly, the Wii U has been a bit of a flop so far, as was arguably expected, you know. It was rather poor launch timing, perhaps, on the console, perhaps a tad underpired, with a bit of a confusion as regards what it actually was, you see. Because, of course, the initial Wii was a console, but the yes. Wii U is not just an upgrade, it's a completely new console, you'll say. Well, it most certainly is, and perhaps at the time of launch, it didn't really have too many sort of nintendo -y fan games coming out with it. Well, I don't know, old boy. You'll see, videos. of course, perhaps some customers are confused as to whether or not the Wii U is just an upgrade, or indeed a completely new console. They also, as a result of this, sales of games on the Wii U have been awful, you know. Most certainly. Well, at the launch of the Wii U, you may remember, they tried to also sell sort of non-mainstream Nintendo games, such as Batman and other such things. That's right, old boy. And of course, since then, they have lost the support of those third-party developers, you know. Most certainly, because perhaps people think, well, if I'm going to play that type of game, I sort of, I play Mario and Nintendo, but all those other games I play on Xbox or PS4. Well, that's or a danger, old boy. For example, yeah. the wonderful 101 was a, well, a second-party game. It got good reviews for it, but you know, it only sold 50,000 copies. Oh, and that's bad in the world of games. That's terrible, I see. Oh, yes, indeed. Also, on the other hand, the 3DS has been doing rather well in the handheld market, certainly dominating the PlayStation Vita, but it's starting to face stiff competition from iPhones, iPads, and a whole host of mobile devices offering cheap, if low-quality, entertainment. It most certainly is, yes indeed. And Nintendo have been talking about possibly doing something on those mobile devices, phones, etc. Well, you'll see, Fidel's, yes. However, just back on the consoles for a moment now, with the PS4 and Xbox One now on the scene, the Wii U is effectively a non-starter. It would take some seriously good games and a lot of advertising to bring it back, you know. It most certainly will, yes. It could be destined for the old doorstop. Well, I, I hope, I like my Wii U, I hope not, I say. Yes. But anyway, Fidel's, regardless of this, as Bertie says, our Nintendo, Nike, considering the unthinkable to cave into these demands and finally start making Mario games on mobile phones, old boy. Well, exactly. It's never been heard of, but will they do it? They suggested perhaps they're not going to go that way, but we don't know. Yes, indeed, that's right, old boy. Nintendo have previously perhaps contradicted themselves there. They're not quite sure what to do. But what has Mr. Iwata, Satoru Iwata, the CEO, had to say, old chap? Hello, everyone. This is Mr. Iwata from Nintendo. And today I am answering a lot of questions because people have been wondering wondering if I'm going to respond to the calls for me to jump off a cliff and other such things like this because of our sales flop. The answer to this is a definitive no. I am going to stay very much in my chair in Nintendo headquarters and I'm here today to tell you why. A little while ago I was going up and down in my kitchen thinking how I can save Nintendo and then I saw I am going to add girls to the new Smash Brothers which is coming out soon. Do you know why I am going to do this? Because girls are making the world go round. Because everyone knows if there are no girls there is no planet. So this good idea will save Nintendo. There are going to be girls in the new Smash Brothers and as such I will stay in Nintendo forever and ever. Also, if you think I am sounding a bit of an idiot because I am speaking like this in English, you just try speaking in Chinese punk. Ha. Oh, just excuse me while I go and tear my clothes. I have just said I am Chinese when actually I am Japanese. Buddy, if Mr. Water hears this, he's going to kill us, old chap. What, what are you doing, I say? What, 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 what,
As you well know, Nintendo are known for pulling the old rabbits out the hat. Uh, yes, old pie, although I don't think he's specifically threatened this time in Vales putting girls in Smash Brothers, but I, I know what you're trying to say, old pie. Oi. But indeed, Vales, Nintendo have in the past been known for pulling tricks, you know. I did their sleeves, as it were. And indeed, we've seen this many times. For example, they thought the original Wii was going to be a flop, but it wasn't. So the question is, is the next quotes Wii just right in the corner, old chap? Ah, it could be, yes, indeed. We, they may suddenly just unveil something special, and they do have a rather committed long-term fan base too. They do, old boy, and I have heard a little rumour floating around the internet somewhere that apparently some sort of new console might be under works. But of course, that's just a rumour at the moment, old boy. Oh, yes, we'll have to wait and see. We'll have to wait and see, but there you go, videos. Make up your own mind whether or not Nintendo are doomed, and do tell us in our forums what you think, old boy. Almost certainly, yes. Get over there and tell us what you think. Have a vote, I say. There you go, then, videos. Thank you for having joining us. And I dare say we look forward to seeing you once more on the next exciting Andy Goddard's Fair. Yes, Until then. Oh, oh, Mr. Owatu, uh, could we have a gerbil game, please?